<laughs> you can take me steps, don't crack me up. <laughs> Baby steps. So, so even when you're going forward. Yeah, yeah that's true. Bro. <laughs> that's that's a bit of goose. Yeah, that's yeah. a bit of goose shit. <laughs> yeah, let's overtake so, these motherfuckers. <laughs> so bend into it. So, oh. There you go, see? Yeah. You see, you went. Yeah. Yeah, that's all, crazy. All that was there. I think the experience today with RJ has been quite interesting, actually. I think I didn't think he'd catch it so quickly. Yeah, yeah. yeah I thought Every, I was gonna. Anyone in the way has a good start. Like, just get out of the way, can I come? Yeah, I was like, get the <laughs> fuck out of my way, mate. <laughs> 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 Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm just gonna take a seat. <laughs> Yo, what's up, bro? Yeah. We fucked up, bro. On the last episode, we saw young people dying for Niash. Here we aim to pick up some skates and die on some wheels. Before we do that, let's hear what people have to say about skating. Okay, so would you like to just introduce yourself? Yes, I'm Empress Gibbs. The question, what are two great things about skating in your opinion? In my opinion, I think the two greatest things is fitness and healing for clarity of mind. And also exercise, like I have become the healthiest, the fittest since I've started skating. Mm. Everybody talks about my six pack and my legs and this and that, and I owe it to skating. <laughs> it's all about skating, so. Yep, my name's Aaron Newell. I'm Jenny Newell. I want to ask you, what are two great things about skating? Convince me. Well, it gives you energy. You know, you stop doing things that you work for a long time when you get to my age. Since I've got back on my skates, the pains that I used to have in my legs have gone because I've strengthened the muscles back in my legs that I used to use back in the day, but just stop using. So it's good, it's good for your health, it's good for exercise, cardio, and most of all, it's fun. So what are two great things about skating in your opinion? Um, I'm always saying the same thing. I think it's the freedom that you can actually engage this by yourself. You don't really need no company. And um, there's so much elements like fitness, you know, it's fun. It's the happening thing, one of the biggest things what happened through the COVID, you know, one of the biggest things globally. Um, and I just want to ask you, what are two interesting things about skating for you? For me, it's a place where it takes me away from anything. Um, sometimes it's hard to wind down with life and everything like that, where I find when you skate, you're free, you don't think about anything. It just puts you in a very nice, calm space. It seemed like I was convinced about skating. Yet, for something I've never done before, it sounded like I had to dig in deeper and understand its community. So, Do you think um, skating uh, is a trend or is it here to stay? I think it has become a trend, but if you know, from we know there's people here at Tower Boring that have been skating since the 80s. I was born in the 80s. So, no, I don't think it's a trend. I think it's something that's definitely going to be here for a long time. If I've got anything to do with it, I want to try and keep it on the map. <laughs> no. Oh, no, it's definitely here to stay. It's been in London and never died out. You got Hyde Park, and there's, there's certain things what keep it alight. Now, um, we've got people like Skate Brom. We're in the park where most of us usually skate and that's the most of the skate community, which is that kind of nail. It's never going to die. There's so much young people now what's engaged with skating. Yeah. You know, it's got a big future, real big. Skating won't die, but I might if I'm not prepared. 
let's see what advice I can get from qualified professionals before I apply my own set of roller skates. Um, and I want to ask you, do you think it's easy for someone like me to start skating? Definitely. I think one thing that was made clear in the movie is that how welcoming everyone is. Like every single interview was like, you know, they welcome me with open arms. Like, they were so, uh, you know, open and everything. So I think it's definitely easy for anyone to get involved. Well, um, I want to ask you, do you think it's easy for someone like me to start skating? Anybody? Yeah, yeah absolutely. If I can do it, anyone can. <laughs> yeah. uh, I teach. So I say literally from the moment you can walk, you can learn how to skate. Um, it's literally, it is, it's one thing, it's not easy. For some people it's e it is easier than others, but it's, nobody can put on a pair of skates and literally just go 100 miles an hour. It's like, it's not possible. It's, it's something it's that you're going to have, you're going to, yeah. no, I didn't. Uh, do you think, uh, it's, uh, do you think it's easy for somebody like me to start skating? I think practice makes perfect. And I do think that in the beginning, People worry about their balance, you know, falling. Every skater falls, no matter how professional you are. The main thing is that you get back up. I want to ask you, is uh, skating a hard thing to pick up? Pick up? I'd say no. It's walking on wheels, right? Falling over and getting up. You're probably thinking, oh my God, that's the hard piece. It's the easiest, it's onto your knees. One foot forward. Hello. <laughs> yeah. Okay, and uh, you know, in terms of you know, myself, do you think someone like me can learn uh, skating in less than two hours? Definitely. I think everything um, is just the same. It's a mental thing. So a lot of people feel it's all about the legs work, but it's how your mindset in the, you know, going inwards and moving forwards. So with the right teacher as well in an hour. All right. right. So, so the ultimate question comes though to this, would you teach me? Yes. Give me literally 24 hours and you can learn how to skate with persistence, one minute song. Alright, so let's say if I gave you two hours, do you think I could actually become a confident person Within from skating? Hours, I, could, I, could, I could, from your confidence, from when you put them on, I guarantee within two hours it would be, you're not going to feel like you're a pro skater. I still don't feel like I'm a pro skater, but I guarantee within two hours your confidence will come from here to here. Um, do you think that someone like me can pick up skating in less than two hours? I would say so. Yeah? You ready for a challenge? Yeah, man, I am ready for a challenge. <laughs> let's do it. <laughs> let's go then, let's go. And just like that, I felt like I made a terrible choice, giving two absolute strangers on wheels my absolute trust. Nonetheless, I was still curious to learn something new. The bet was on. Could I learn this in just a few hours? Okay. Uh, okay. This is why I so, say the, the first 10 right, right, minutes, okay. half an hour. Will be the uh, worst. So it's basically the balance and everything. Yeah, yeah. So we're basically learning about balance and we're learning about how we can kind of like, you know, engage with the it's, road and it's the pathway. It's learning your your center and your ego. Yeah. Your, 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 yeah. your, yeah. You have to think. Every time, it's everything's about trying to stay centered because if you lean backwards, you're going you're gonna to you, go, back. go backwards. If you yeah. lean forward, you're, you're going to go, go forward. Whereas, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whereas normally when you're in your shoes, obviously you have that stability. You, you yeah. can move forward and backwards. Yeah. You don't have that on, on wheels. On wheels, yeah. yeah. So it's always trying to have yourself just in that center balance. And that's all people, naturally people that have, every, everyone walks around, nobody walks around with, with, yeah. with, with great posture. Yeah. That's so good, it's so good. <laughs> think about it, like I always say to people, like think about it, like when you got a string yeah. that comes from like a, a string or a pole, that comes from the top of your head oh, and yeah. goes right down your spine and comes <laughs> yeah. your back, right? Straight the way through. Straight the way through. Okay. And you want to keep your back, your neck, everything aligned. Yeah. Okay. Before you have to learn how to how to skate, you have to know how to walk. This yeah. Is, see, look, now we're more centered now, now because the hill's gone. There you go. So take uh, time. And you don't have to walk like yeah, yeah. shoes. You can take smaller steps off of the ground. They don't have to be massive. Oh, okay. You just take smaller steps, take your time. Like that. There you go. Oh. <laughs> Yo, this is yeah, this is crazy. But yeah, no, it, like it really feels like I feel like a little baby. Yeah, like, I just baby. feel yeah, like I feel like there's no sensation <laughs> to like the floor. I don't feel like there's a connection. Yes. I just feel like I'm levitating, and it's like the first time I'm doing this. I feel like I'm high, man. But like my, just my feet, you know what I mean? You're like you're floating right now. Yeah, yeah, basically. Like it's just crazy because like even like 
you know, I've, I feel like I'm engaging muscles that I haven't kind of like You've never this is before, before, yeah, before, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And these mu those muscles need to get used to working. Yeah. And engaging. <laughs> yeah. All at the same time. <laughs> How do you feel about RJ's performance so far? Uh, he's doing, he's doing actually really well. Um, naturally. Is RJ's progress even within the first literally 15, 20 minutes? It was actually really well. Um, his his confidence from when he put the skates on in the first place. Obviously, he was holding onto my arm as soon as he put them on, and he, he was nearly cutting off my, my circulation. And literally, give it 10 minutes, and he's barely barely gripping and on anymore. Finding that center. So as you're doing it, I feel like I'm doing the split. Oh, oh, it, yeah, yeah, yeah. See what I'm saying? Okay. So if he was just to do that, it looks easy. Me and he, me and Aaron can do this all day. Yeah. But when we first got on skates, yeah. it wasn't so easy. Yeah. But what it does help you to do is to just find, that find your equilibrium yeah. and find yeah. your centre. Yeah, yeah. Because you have to have your knees bent, certainly. That's true. And don't be afraid of the rolling. Okay. If you find yourself rolling, just roll into it until you find your yeah. balance again. Okay. Yeah? You got this. Take your time. That's it, you, you got go. it. Take your time, you got it. That's it. Alright, so basically, it's the confidence, the stance, yeah. and then just doing. Yeah, that's it, that's yeah. it. Take your time. If you feel like you're going anywhere, you just stay there still. There you go, that's it. Well done. That's okay. It. You got this. Take your time. Yo. See? And you're skating. That's it, you got this. Okay. You got this? Yeah, what? Come on. Yeah, you did. Come on. Alright, fair enough, bro. Say less. <laughs> You can do it. You got this. You all right? You skating. You got this. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. We did it. Yeah. yeah. All right. So I'm not supposed to be looking forward. No, yeah. No. Ahead. You do want to be looking forward because you want your head to be up. Yeah. 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 You're more likely to sit yeah. rather than tip forward or backwards. And if you do find yourself tipping backwards, one piece of advice I think always works really well. If you bend your knees. Yeah. And it's better to fall on your bum than it is to fall on your face. Oh, on, the, on your face. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> no, you're right. Yeah, you're right so, so if you're falling, literally, there you go. Come on, RJ. Let's go. Hey, Let's go. Come on. Yeah, I'm like inventing dance moves out here, bro. <laughs> yeah. Just say it, it's yeah. Me yeah, trust me. Yeah, like I do. The one thing that I do feel at the moment is that like my my uh, ankles yeah, are yeah. kind of feeling like really strained. Yeah, um, and it's yeah, and the yeah. shins as well. Yeah. Um, that more so is inlines. Yeah. But that's because naturally. With the inlines, because you're holding that stability hmm. of your of yeah, your feet. Yeah, your body's in yeah. that part. Your like, body's not used to. If you take it. your boot off now, yeah, your boot will fall over to, and it hit the floor. Yeah, because it's it's, it's yeah, because it's the center of gravity yeah. is like it's in the, the center line. Sense point. Sense yeah. I can take my boot off and I can push it; it will roll all the way down there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And it's because it's 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 even. So yeah. for, as soon as for us just standing on quads, yeah. We don't have to, we're not doing anything. The only thing we have to do to stop oh, moving yeah. is put our feet on a V. Feet, however we yeah. stand. As soon as you hit inlines, you have to stabilize your feet the whole time you're on. Yeah, you're on, you have to be yeah. actually aware yeah. that you're actually walking on wheels. Because naturally, yeah. if you don't. So, in terms of a checklist, what have I done so far? All right, so, so far, you've, you've built your confidence you've built enough. Your confidence. Yeah. yeah. You found you your found, equilibrium, mm -hmm. finding your balance. Yeah. And you're actually learning how to walk in these as well, to skate in these more so like, you know like when you first started, yeah. people kind of walk like they're walking in shoes. Yeah. Like, watch that. Like Ooh. they're walking in shoes. Yeah, that's shit bro. You're not doing that now. <laughs> that's, that's, a <laughs> that's a bit of goose. That's a bit of goose shit. So, coming to a hill, yep. keeping these bent. We're here. We got ya. Okay. Yeah, let's so overtake hold. these motherfuckers. Keep these so bend back. into it. Bend oh. Oh. Ah. There you go, see? Yeah. You see, you went. Yeah, yeah, that's all, crazy. All that was ah. there, because it ah. went into oh, a hill. Yeah. It's bringing, bringing yourself into it. Yeah. But still, because you was leaning back. Yeah. Best, oh, best okay, so I kind of, yeah. You can just, you can just yeah. Actually, sometimes, I think the, 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 the hardest thing to do is learn how to let yourself fall. Okay. Yeah. Because Naturally, Let's do it again. A reaction when you trip. Well, we're still on the hill, yourself. just keeping these bent. There you go. Bent. Just let it roll. Stay forward. Stay forward. Stay forward. Stay That's forward. It. Just let it roll. Stay forward. That's it, baby. Oh. Oh. Damn. Oh. That's terrible. Oh yeah. You know I'm gonna sit there for a while. Oh. Take a rest. Take a rest. Nah, nah, nah. It's all good. It's all... Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, let's yeah, yeah, let's take a rest. Let's, let's take a rest. After a few minutes of having felt like I was embarrassing myself than actually learning something, I thought it best to just sit down and reflect on Empress's and Aaron's advice. I think the experience today with RJ has been quite interesting actually. I think I didn't think he'd catch it so quickly. I think he, once he understood that it's more about the confidence, because I think that's like the majority part of skating is having the confidence in what you're doing because everything else can be learnt. So I think his strength was definitely just kind of grasping, listening, taking it all in and applying it as well, which is why within 15, 20 minutes he was skating, really. Um, um, so one, his confidence is growing. Two, he's learning the stability of his actual body uh, naturally because he's on skates. I've tried to explain the fact of you have to be in centre gravity um, and he's starting to understand the process. Um, three, now he's the, where he's going to go on to, um, he's, he's got to find his own little space and not try to kind of follow, on, like follow anyone because he's got the basics of what to do now. Um, and yeah, he's just letting his confidence keep growing with it. And on with that, he'll just continue to keep getting better as long as he keeps putting his skates on. Really? Um, weaknesses? I don't really like to look at it as weaknesses because I think everything can be improved upon but I think his improvements could definitely be in terms of his balance and just find his equilibrium when he's changing on the different terrains but overall I had an amazing experience and actually it kind of gave me hope for other people. As soon as we come down it, yeah. the, it comes slightly back up a little bit okay. so you're going to come down and it's going to slow you straight away as soon as you hit down. Okay, let's give that a go. Got, you got, got, uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm, 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 I'm just gonna take a seat. <laughs> <laughs> we started out well. Be ready for this. So, even if you have to hold your okay. knees just a little bit so you don't fly yourself back, but just hold that space. Just hold it. Don't go backwards. Don't go forward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're, you're right. You're right. You're right. You're all right. You're all right. That's it. Yeah, we're going right in the world. That's it. That's it. Forward with it. Forward with it. See, all that happened then was your weight, your weight came behind you. Yeah. Because yeah. what you're doing when you're going forwards, what you're doing is this. Yeah. You don't want to do that. Yeah. You need to keep. I need to hold my ground and yeah, I feel yeah. like. You need to yeah, literally yeah, yeah. keep this position. Keep yeah. that position. Maybe it's childhood trauma, I don't know, like just kind of holding me back here. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> you got this? All right, cool. Come Let's do it again. Time. You got this. Yeah. Let's do it. So, I've got it. You've got this. I've got it. And should I be looking forward or down? Straight ahead. You want to look where you're going. Where your aim point and where you want to go to is where you want to be. So, look at Yannis. Look at Yannis. There you go. Look at that. Stay right there. Stay Bam. Right there. Stay right there. there. Oh. You had that then, bro. You had that then, bro. You had that then, bro. You had that one. Yeah. You bailed that. Yeah, you I know. That. I'm telling you. Come uh, on, bro. Bro. You had it. Come on, we're going to do it again. That's it. We're going to do it again. Yeah. Oh. By the end of today, that's what we will. You're gonna roll down into that camera by yourself. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah. All right. So. Right. Yeah. All right. Let's do it. Go. Go. Let's go. Let's go. So remember, just bend your knees. Yeah. And just let yourself roll. Hold it. There you go. Perfect position. Perfect. You know. Yeah. I am not doing it. You're gonna do well. it, bro. I promise you. It's yeah. Panicked, then, then. Yeah, I know, I know. I panicked. Uh, we'll we'll give it a go. Because um, I, like, I think like my issue is, and I'm just being like uh, honest with it, like you know, with my vibe right now. Yeah, yeah. I feel like every time I'm falling, I'm kind of like forgetting the things that you I've learned before. Yeah, shake it off. Okay. Like, literally shake it off. You got this. Take a deep breath. All right. Hold my arm for this one. Yeah. We're gonna okay. get one holding my arm. Okay. Yeah. Don't lean back. Okay. We're gonna go down together. So, yeah. forward, so, bend your knees. So, bend, bend into those it knees. as you would. That's there it. you go. Keep and hold bending. that position. Stay right there. Don't try yeah. to. Stay yeah. right there. Stay Keep right there. Up. Stay right Keep there. Stay up. right there. Don't, don't right pull. There. Don't pull. Just let your legs go. <laughs> Whoa. That, that was just the pull because yeah. you pulled with your arms. I know. You know the minute. Yeah. All it is because as soon as you pull with your arms, you're yeah. not taking it. Obviously, your legs have to do all the, all the, work. All the work. Yeah, yeah. Now, the minute you pull with your arms, yeah. You, you make your legs light. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. So okay, so you want to push from the right first because that's your strongest. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We, we, yeah, wherever your strongest wherever leg is. But as, so as it's going, it that left. left. But it's going to be the same movement through with both. There you go. See? 
See, yeah. I can tell. <laughs> You're right footed, then it? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Keep going, keep going, keep going. That's it. You got it. Now you're going to hit the hill. That's it. Keep going. Keep going. Charging through. Keep going. That's it. Keep going. Use your arms. Keep going. That's it. Yeah, we. Uh, that's a wrap, guys. Yes, we can. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, give me yeah, a high five. Yeah, that's really good. No, no, no. Yeah. yeah, and then you know, while we're here, let's just do downhill quickly. Let's see if we actually hack it. Let's go. Right, let's see if we can. Keep so. your knees bent. You've got this. That's it. Listen up. The final fucking round. Come on, bro. Let's fucking <laughs> do it. Don't worry about them. They'll yes. move. Yeah, no worries. Stay bent. Stay forward, stay, stay, stay forward, stay forward, stay forward. That's it, stay with it. And we got you. Stay with it, stay with it. You got it, you got it. Oh, you almost did it. You almost did it, bro. You got it. Nearly, 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 Okay. What am I doing weak right now? Two things I'm doing weak that I need to improve immediately. Let's do it. It's literally just. It, it's just in there okay because your physical ability now you have it all right right you see like how you are right now just bend your knees don't go forward or backwards okay that's where you want to be okay so you don't want to be here you like don't want to do here so let's yeah. do it you got this. let's do it i move right here bro that's it now that's it stay, hold that position right, just stay there. hold it stay right there hold you got it. it don't worry hold you got it. it you've got it stay right there my stay G. right there my g my, <laughs> g, my g 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 yeah. That, that, that one more yeah. little e extra push. Um, okay. You know, just to kind of like wrap this activity from here then, yeah. what are two good things that you can say about my performance today and, uh, and what you'd say to like new learners, you know, who are coming here for the future? Mm -hmm. To just look at your willingness to, you have to be open-minded for one. Mm -hmm. And just, if you're in an environment where people are trying to help you. Mm -hmm. Accept you, it. Yeah, accept their help and ex the f finally except that you are going to have falling over yeah. is going to be part of the process yeah, yeah. so if you're scared about falling over just put, put, affirm put, put, put it and empress what do you think about like two things that i did well and what would you say to new learners coming here for the future with skate buddies mm, i think the two things that you've done really well was pushing through yeah i could see mentally you were shutting down but it's like you you've also realized that little kick and that that's something that keeps you going, that little flame inside you that's like, oh, Let's okay, I might be hurting, but one more try. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? And I think I really love that about mm. what you did. And I think it's just for new learners, it's just understanding that it's a process. Mm. I mean, yeah, we all go through those barriers. We all have to push through those barriers from ourselves, from our own inhibitions and like, mm. oh, my fear and falling. But you've took a couple of falls, you've got back up and you keep going. Yeah. And I think that's important for beginners because some people fall, yeah. they get back up, but they don't get back up on their skates. Yes, yeah. And wherever. But well, how do you but feel You now? learn to let go. But uh, personally, what I feel is I feel really confident because I feel like the people like I'm surrounding myself by like yourself and you know you Aaron you know uh, it's like you know it's very warm and it's very you know what do you call it like in well very engaging mm -hmm. and it's very immersive as well yeah. like you kind of provide me an experience where you know of collaboration of community where I can just accept the falls yeah. I can get back up again and just be him you know what I mean so uh, it's just That's one of those type of things really so yeah 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 so uh, yeah thank you very much and uh, we'll see you later thank you bro yeah, just I love that. Thank Guys, you. That was best, absolutely... best experience ever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We finally did it. We learnt something new and we hope you enjoyed our journey of self discovery. Roller skating is an enriching activity where you can join its existing community and make new friends and jam. But most importantly, never let the fear of falling down take away from the experience of being yourself or becoming something better. Enjoy the process and be yourself.